In order to complete the cost tab, we will need to include some remaining costs for this village electrification project. What are these costs? Well, for the base case, we need to include the cost of grid extension. Uh, so that's 35 kilometers of new grid at 500,000 quatcha per kilometer for the power line. For the proposed case, we've got all the initial costs in there. We've got all the annual O&M costs in there, at least that we're aware of currently. Uh, but we do have to think about a periodic cost, which is battery replacement every 13 years. Uh, and I would assume that the cost to replace the batteries is only 40% of the initial costs. Why? Because first there's a number of components that uh, we need to be included initially but that don't need replacement after 13 years. So it's only the battery cells themselves that might need replacement. Second, the cost of batteries is coming down a lot and quite quickly. So you might expect a, a significant reduction in the cost of the battery 13 years in the future. So give that a try, completing the cost tab, and uh, I'll show you the solution momentarily. All right, we already have the initial costs here. What we're going to add here is for the base case, grid extension costs. And this is a credit. Why do we say credit? Because we're interested in the incremental cost of the proposed case versus the base case. So we want to include the initial costs of the proposed case as positive values and the initial costs of the base case need to be subtracted from those in order to find the incremental initial costs. So that means we include them as a credit, which turns them into negative numbers. So I'm going to put in 35 kilometers here at 500,000 quacha per kilometer. And you'll see this number is in parentheses, indicating it's a negative number that then gets subtracted from the initial cost of the proposed case system. So the net incremental cost, initial cost of the photovoltaic plus battery plus genset system is just under a million quacha. The other thing we had to include here, and we can just verify that indeed the operating and initial, the operating and maintenance costs as well as the fuel costs and the electricity costs are all included here. Uh, but the periodic costs of battery replacement in the proposed case are not yet there. So I'm going to assume after 13 years there's going to be a cost for this and it should be 40% of the battery cost. So the battery is currently around 10 million quacha so I'm going to say around 4 million quacha here. Now that's the cost of battery replacement in today's money, today's quacha. Red Screen's going to inflate this cost by the inflation rate we specify. But in today's money, I'm assuming a battery will cost 40% of what it costs now after all the cost reductions that occur over 13 years and also considering that we only need to re replace the cells, we don't need to include um, say all the infrastructure around the battery for replacement. Next we can look at the emissions reductions if any associated with this project and the financial analysis results. 